Good afternoon, Moreau Catholic High School. This is Justin Deep Singh Olick here, your everyday man, oh giving you the weekly library podcast. So, let's start off with the most important news of the day. With my two guests, I'll introduce them. William Miller, Robert Kionis. Uh, William, what is the most important news of the week? That would be the library news. All right. Robert, what's the first thing on the hit list? Well... He doesn't know. He doesn't know. I think that would be live at MCHS. Okay. So, for those of you that don't know, we just had a live... Our second live at MCHS event. It was here at Moreau, and uh, William Miller, one of our own, was actually part of that event, and we'll be happy to tell you about his thoughts on that event right now. Well, as you may or may not know, this uh, live at MCHS event was all about pop culture. So what we ended up doing this time was we had a panel of very, very highly esteemed students and teachers, and a wonderful moderator in the name of Mr. Baptist. What ended up happening was there was a large amount of ideas and contribution from both students and faculty, and it really bridged the gap between what students think and what teachers think. It gave a good insight into how teachers aren't just teachers, they're people, too. And it's a great example of how that can happen. And uh, I was Kanye, so naturally I thought it was amazing. But what were you for the Live at MCHS thing? No, I'm kidding. Okay. Um, personally, my favorite thing at Live at MCHS was that it was uh, moderated by our very own Jesus Christ. Right. And I didn't know he was available for uh, that kind of job, but uh, shout out to him. Shout out. Um, what else? You know, I know, uh, Robert, I'll get you on this one. So Thanksgiving just uh, happened. And, uh, what is that even supposed to that? mean? Oh, well... Did you, you get know, any good food? Well, yeah, well, I mean, it, 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 that, it just comes with the territory. I mean, last week, you know, you guys had that three days, and then break and all that stuff. I was sick the entire time. Oh. I was actually, I was out. No, you know, it was actually not that bad. It was just, it was just, you know, it was, well, anyway. Um, Let's get to the food. The I, main when, part when, of Thanksgiving. Uh, Thanksgiving. Oh, well, well, actually, the main part of Thanksgiving is being thankful. And being, coming together as a family. And coming together as a family. For. But the second most important part is the food. What did you eat? Uh, when, 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 at my Thanksgiving dinner, we, uh, whatever, uh, we're, 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 fil- we're basically part Filipino, right? So we had, like, chicken adobo, rice, different kind of rice, Latin rice. And then, of course, we had, you know, like, our, the mashed potatoes, the turkey, mm-hmm. etc. Yeah. Uh, I didn't, I didn't go overboard, you know, I just... Had enough See, to get, get good, you know, not trying to stuff myself or anything. That's what I always find so interesting, because every every family will have a turkey. You know, you got that turkey, but it's the extra things, you know, that really shows. Like, obviously, I had, you know, some uh, curry and rice and just some, you know, some bread and some yeah, non-Indian yeah, yeah, dessert. Non-bread. Yeah, non bread. Non's actually amazing. Uh, non-bread. Indian like, dessert. Shout out to Indian food. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. And you know, and it's just it's just the sides that really make it. You know, and then uh, like, what did you have? Like my family has like cranberry. Like I mean, they have all kinds of stuff. You wouldn't. Okay, you wouldn't know what a poonch tort is, but if you would, it's delicious. Is it? It is. What delicious. is a, a, a poonch like tort? tort? It's like a cake. It's, wow. it's really amazing. It's Hungarian. Oh, oh you're, you're Hungarian? Hungarian? I'm Hungarian. Why well, didn't I didn't know that? <laughs> well, now you do. Wow. Well, well library my eyes have been open. There's your fun fact of the day. All right, I'm glad. Because well, well, uh, well, speaking well, of the fun fact of the day, we should also go with the book of the week. Oh, book of the week. Okay. Who could forget that? The book of the week this week is going to be uh, a kind of a tough book for a lot of you guys. Because uh, it's a tough book for me. Uh, and it's The Fountainhead by Anne Rand. And I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. But it's uh, it's one of her three most uh, esteemed books, The Fountainhead, Atlas Shrugged, and Anthem. And it's a hugely uh, philosophical book that talks about how man's ego... Anne Ryan is her name. Anne Ryan, Ryan. is it? Oh, my God. Um, that talks about how man's ego is essentially the source for all uh, human uh, evolution. You know, it's, it's a crazy book. I've only read uh, up to... Uh, the second part of the introduction. It's uh, no, I've tried. That might sound like not much, but it's really hard reading. I mean, and a lot of people might know. Fun fact: for those of the fans of the game Bioshock, the book that she wrote, Atlas Shrugged, is has a heavy part mm-hmm. in Bioshock. Mm-hmm. Just so you know. So that's two fun facts well, for the day. That's great to know. I didn't know either of you could read. So well, uh, we do. So that's fun fact number three. There's your third fun fact for the day. Moreau Catholic High School will leave you with those three fun facts. And uh, that'll be our library. Uh, anything else, William Miller? Um, happy to have a Thanksgiving, and I'm looking forward to next week. Uh, anything else, Robert Kionis? Counting down to days to Christmas break. All, all right. Amen. Already and, open my uh, advent calendar. Sorry for waiting so long for this library podcast, but uh, stay classy, Moreau.